Hi, welcome to PT Dennis videos and Body Peak supplements. Today we're going to be talking about your thyroid. Why? Because your thyroid affects your metabolism. Now, a lot of people when they struggle to lose weight start looking at the nutrition, exercise, supplements. They don't look at their internal chemistry and biology, such as their hormones. So today we're going to be talking about thyroid. Now your hypothalamus in your brain receives and sends information based on what it's learnt and it, one of the things it produces is what we call a thyroid releasing hormone, TH, TRH. Thyroid releasing hormone now gets passed down into your pituitary gland which produces thyroid stimulating hormone, TSH. Now TSH is one of the most important hormones in your body because that's what tells your thyroid to become active. So your pituitary gland produces thyroid stimulating hormone and that goes into your thyroid. So your thyroid is a little butterfly shaped gland that sits directly underneath your Adam's apple. Your thyroid produces, a, well predominantly produces a hormone called T4. Now T4 is one of the main hormones in your body that actually affects your metabolism. So this is the big one. It's called T4 because it is a thyroxine, which it's, well T4 is actually thyroxine, with four iodine molecules bonded and attached to it. So that's why it's called T4. So it's called T4 because it's thyroxine with four iodine molecules attached. Now, when your thyroid produces T4, the T4 passes through your blood and travels to your tissues. There in your tissues, one of those iodine molecules break off and it becomes T3. Now, T3 is what goes into your genes and affects your metabolism directly, not T4. So think of T4 more as a pro-hormone. It's the most important because without T4, you're not going to get any T3. But T4 is, an, is the one that regulates your metabolism but doesn't directly affect your metabolism. It's not until the T4 goes in the tissues, breaks down the T3. Your T3 now in your tissues travels through the cell wall into your genes where you'll find your DNA. And it directly influences your DNA. Once it influences your, your DNA inside your cells, it actually, those genes and your DNA now communicate with other proteins in your body and in your blood, and your proteins now affect your body's metabolism in a range of different ways. So that's, this is how the whole process works. Um, so now the question is, how does T4 affect your body's physical changes. Well, arrange changes in a range of different ways from, from your energy levels to the way your body can burn fat, etc. So these are some of the ways you might find that I'll recognize the fact that you might have low thyroid. Um, so if you're struggling to lose weight, if you have a very low energy levels, you may have a low producing thyroid. Now, what's really fascinating about all this is that another great way women can actually tell is by a loss of hair. So if your hair tends to be dry and brittle, or if you're actually losing hair, that's a really big way of, of determining uh, whether somebody has um, T4 problems. So basically, at Body Peak Supplements, if somebody walks in through the door and they're looking to lose body fat and they're struggling to lose weight, and they say, I've, I've tried all the supplements on the market, I ask them how their energy levels, and if their diet's good, their exercise is good, they're getting good sleep, and their energy levels are still low, then I'll notice that they have brittly hair or their hair might be falling out. I can instinctively know that they may have a thyroid problem. Now, I won't try to fix it. Obviously, the first thing you need to do is go to your doctor and get a blood test to double check. But there are a lot of fat loss supplements specifically on the market, such as Oxyelite powder that's specifically designed to stimulate your thyroid and therefore regulate metabolism and speed up your body's ability to burn fat. one of two things. It's either your pituitary gland isn't producing enough thyroid stimulating hormone or your thyroid itself may be damaged or not actually producing any T4. 
Um, out of the two, it's normally the second option. So your pituitary gland tends to be um, naturally regulating quite efficiently. It tends to be your thyroid itself that might, might be damaged. So this is the one thing uh, that, as a trainer, we can't fix. It's something that you've got to go see your doctor about. Um, so just a quick rundown. Um, your brain produces thyroid regulating hormone that goes to your pituitary gland that produces thyroid stimulating hormone that goes to your thyroid that produces T4. T4 travels through your blood to your tissues where T4 now becomes T3. The T3 now goes into your cells affecting your DNA that affects your proteins regulating metabolism. It's affecting your body's ability to produce, sorry, to burn fat, to increase energy levels. It affects your metabolism. It's normally, the problem normally doesn't lie in your pituitary gland producing um, thyroid stimulating hormone. It tends to be the actual thyroid itself that might be damaged. If you need any other questions, you can email me anytime you like or post any comments and I'll try my very best to get back to you ASAP. Uh, don't forget to like this video and don't forget to please uh, log on to our Facebook page and like Body Peak Supplements. Talk to you soon. Bye.